The first stage in a Fluxion attack is to capture the handshake. Now I'm going to show you what uh, Wi-Fi adapters I'm using. So I will type W uh, config. IW config. This will show that I have two Wi-Fi adapters. WLAN0 is a built-in Wi-Fi adapter which does not have monitor mode. And WLAN1 is the external USB Wi-Fi adapter which is capable of monitor mode. My WLAN0 will be used later on to become the fake access point. And WLAN1 will be used to de-authenticate the user from the network from the access point and also to capture the handshake and for WLAN 1 I'm using the same Wi-Fi adapter as before which is the uh, Wi-Fi adapter known as Alpha Alpha AWUS036NHA which you can check uh, from the previous lessons. So now let's clear the screen. And now, as you can see on the top right hand corner, there is uh, my network uh, manager is running, but we need to stop this network manager because otherwise it will interfere with our attacks now when you are using when you are using Fluxion it is necessary to stop the network manager so the command to stop network manager is service network dash manager stop Next is we need to kill the script that connects to WPA and that script is known as WPA supplicant and the command to kill WPA supplicant is amon ng check kill press enter and again when you are using Fluxion, it is necessary to kill WPA supplicant. WPA supplicant has now been successfully killed, as you can see from here. WPA supplicant. Next, change into the directory called dash forward slash opt where you install Fluxion. So type cd forward slash opt followed by ls to list the contents of the opt directory then you will see there is a fluxion directory so type cd fluxion to enter the fluxion directory and once you are inside fluxion directory type ls so we need to use the fluxion sh script so type dot forward slash fluxion sh press enter and fluxion will now go ahead and scan for the necessary dependency files and then it will ask you to select a wireless attack so choose number two handshake snooper acquiring encryption hashes press to enter and it asks you to select which wi-fi adapter choose wlan1 the one with monitor mode so enter number two for me And then select a channel. I'm choosing number one, all channels. And then a pop up window will start scanning for available access points to attack. So once you see a target, for me it's IoT Lab, press Ctrl C to close the scanner window. And it will list the available targets. For me, it's target number 14 so I'll type 14 
and press enter. Select a wireless interface for target tracking. I will choose the first one, which is WLAN 1, monitor mode enabled. So choose one, press enter. And then this attack has already been configured. Select two to reset the attack. Select a method of handshake retrieval. Select number two, air replay ng the authentication. Press two. Enter. Select interface for monitoring and jamming. Select number one. Press enter. And then select a method of verification. Select number three. Calpati verification recommended. Press enter. How often should the verifier check for handshake? Select number one every 30 seconds. How should verification occur? Select number two. Asynchronously recommended. Now the attack has started. On the bottom right corner is the, the authentication window or the jammer window which will disconnect the any computer connected to the access point. Once the computer tries to reconnect, that's when we capture the handshake. So on the left hand side bottom is the window you should monitor to check see whether the handshake has been captured or not. So give it some time and you find handshake snooper attack completed. The handshake has been captured. So we can just close this window. So we close the window and now we are ready to proceed. So we we'll proceed with the attack in the next lesson. So you can just safely exit this by pressing Ctrl C. See you in the next lesson. Thank you for watching.